Hello Cancer, welcome to your Soulmates and Twin Flames reading for the week ahead. Let's go ahead and have a look at what Cancer needs to know about their Soulmate or Twin Flame for the week ahead. Spirit, tell me about Cancer for the week ahead with their Soulmate and their Twin Flame. Cancer, their Soulmate and Twin Flame. What does Cancer need to know? Oh, Twin and Labour. That's interesting. Twin and labor is all about something that is too hard to do and it's not really worth your time. Twin and labor, this person in this card is working harder than what she should in order to receive not even enough for a bit of food. She's working very hard. So when it comes down to it, it's telling me that Cancer, you may be putting in more effort for this relationship or for this connection than what you should be. You know, they say with all relationships, you have to meet each other in the middle. But it's like this person's here and they might even be withdrawn and you're like going all the way. This is you doing too much in order for something to move forward and you're getting like breadcrumbs in return. Um, okay, I'll do this. Tell me about toil and labor for my cancers. Tell me about, yeah, service. It's really trying to open the door to opportunity and then being disappointed in turn. My heart just sort of, I just feel so sad about that because I don't like seeing anyone getting hurt or anybody not being treated fairly or correctly. And I feel that cancer, you're not being treated fairly. You're not being treated right in this situation. Uh, it's just coming out that way. And the way I'm feeling, it's like uh, my heart is breaking and I, I can totally understand. Spirit, tell me what is your guidance for my cancer exactly? Um, Eight of Cups, you know, Eight of Cups is about soul searching and moving forward with that soul searching mindset. Like I'm going to go and search for something that makes me feel good, okay? Because, you know, you, but it, it, see how the cups are still upright? He's gone, but he's keeping them upright. It's saying, I still feel my heart is still here to this person who I really, really want to be with, who I really want their attention or I really want things to go forward. I haven't knocked them over. I still feel it and I still have hopes, but I need to go and I need to, to reflect for a little while. I need to think about this because I think I've just used up so much of my energy trying to get to a certain point and it hasn't been working out. Clarity. So this is moving forward in order for clarity, in order to figure something out. I need to go away for a little while to think so that I can figure out exactly what I want to do with my life with myself with this situation next we have ten of swords and five of swords so this is saying you're going away for a little while your heart is still there you still feel that you still love them you still you know you still have hopes that things are going to be okay at the same time when you go away you're going away with over analyzing overthinking and you know creating a bit of a headache for yourself with five of swords and ten of swords to achieve clarity but again, Spirit's showing me that in order to do that, you're going through the Ten of Swords and Five of Swords, the extreme cards in order to achieve clarity. All right, they're like to the max. They're like clarity, but then headache, 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 
in order to achieve this spirit might be saying you don't need all these extra cards in order for this okay you don't need all this extra energy put into an ace of swords in order to achieve the ace of swords just accept what your heart is telling you you don't have to go away and then beat yourself up with these cards you don't have to go away and hurt yourself mentally in order to achieve clarity spirit what is upcoming for my cancers it might be a leo that you're dealing with okay now five of wands is about conflict it could be internal conflict or it could be conflict with this person okay it could be that you're fighting for something fighting for that loyalty fighting for that alliance fighting for that oneness fighting for what you had it's like to achieve clarity and you come back and you're like no you know what i'm gonna fight for this i know what we have is really special and i'm not going to let this go because i'm loyal to you okay spirit what else would you like to say to my cancers ace of wands i can see that the energies are flowing and they're turning around ace of wands is a new passion this is something completely new okay it could be this if it's a leo it could be this leo but this is i want to fight for the loyalty and then we've got ace of wands it's a renewed passion all right so it could be a renewed passion in this in this energy with this person okay you might spark them fire them up this is all about that spark that flame that catalyst to passion just you know that desire that excitement you know all right let's do this that energy tell me more about the ace of wands for my cancers what do they need to know wow palace of wands that's going to be fun you're gonna have a great time <laughs> um palace of wands is like um a very exciting place to be it, it could be a party an event being one on one with your person and just really enjoying each other's company and closeness um ace of wands is like that renewed passion and palace of wands is all about spending a lot of time together just together with ace of wands energy it's like really nice it's it's a beautiful energy especially when you're trying to renew that passion um, so I feel that this energy between you and this person who you've been doing a lot for I can see that and you need to go away and introspect and you need to think about it and then you come back with crystal crystal clear clarity and then you're going to fight for it it's like nope I want this we're going to make this work and I really want you to put in as much as I am and then let's ace of wands palace of wands together so it looks like a great ending to what seemed to be something that was going like this it suddenly goes like this when you return and that's why that was important about you keeping the cups upright keep them there all right cancer what seemed to be not working out it could end up being a very fiery very passionate connection cancer i hope you enjoyed this reading and i hope it gives you hope and inspiration to move forward and as always i send you love peace and light bye for now